All right, got a little uh, got a little scam going on with the truck. It took me a day and a half to find a website, and I think there's a vacuum hose somewhere coming off the transmission. So we're gonna go up here and see if they have a vacuum hose diagram which I've already found but I don't know if that's the ticket but we're gonna find out Yeah, we're gonna get Barbie another test ride. Started her up yesterday and today. Let it warm up, no oil leaks. I'm totally baffled and amazed about that shit. And then on the way home, we're going to talk about ISIS. And I'm going to draw some parallels to World War II. Which is not going to be well received. I expect that. But hey. That's okay. It's not what I want to do. It's just uh, something a student of history would be looking at. So I had them try to look up the hose. What size is it? Yeah, no shit. That's why I'm asking you. I said, let's go to transmission, see if they have a diagram. Nope. <clears throat> but then I noticed, oh, it's got a modulator. Let's go to the modulator. These guys are like, where the fuck are you coming from? I'm like, just bring up the modulator. So I look up the modulator, it shows it has a modulator, but then down in the writing, it says only 35% of that year and model have a modulator. <coughs> Steak and egg burritos, baby. with sour cream, cheese, <clears throat> guacamole sauce, hot salsa, Now I forgot what the other thing I picked up was. Man, you guys can eat that Taco Bell shit all you want. I'll eat for two days on these. The dogs will be pissed off. Because they won't get none. No, oh, we're going to talk about ISIS. We're going to talk about ISIS, what they're doing now. Because today, early this morning, I was fucking around and I stumbled onto 
Japanese atrocity videos from World War II. And they filmed themselves chopping heads off, you know, British, Australians, Americans, Koreans, Chinese. And then basically it went to um, Harry Truman nuking them. Which is uh, kind of along the lines that I've been saying. Nuke these rotten bastards. I don't know what else you can do. And don't get me wrong, I'm not one that says I want to put troops in there. Because I don't. Because anybody that gets captured is going to get fucking slaughtered by ISIS. So I think we need to drop some strategic nukes on them. Best I can give you. Oh my God, your FBI. <laughs> you should try it in Sub-Zero with. Well, I tell you what, I got some dumb fuckers that work in this store. <clears throat> I'm pretty much done buying from these clowns. This is the same guy that jumped my ass for going in the cooler last time I was up here. So I didn't have my bear on the shelf. So I went okay. Because when I walked in I saw he was working. <clears throat> so I ordered my smokes and said while you're at it, go in the back and get me a case of beer. Because it's not on the shelf. Are you sure? I said, you want me to do it? Again? He knew who I was, too. Nope, I'll do it. So then he comes out and comes out with my case of beer and I said did you restock the shelf nope don't have time for it I said really amazing that's why I went in your cooler the last fucking time and I said I checked it doesn't say employees only fucking douchebags Every store around here has a walk-in fucking cooler. Hell, I can do it in fucking come and go. Just fucking amazes me the stupidity of the help that they hire. Or don't hire.
All right, let's park over here and we'll see if it leaks. Still nothing. Fucking another great BMW mystery.